What's up guys, Step Your Game up here with another video. If you are new to the channel, please hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that notification. We are trying a new deck today. Uh, it is green red. It doesn't seem to be working out the way I thought it would work out, but it is missing a lot of uh, a lot of creature cards, actually. There's tons of creature cards that I don't have in here. So uh, let's see what happens today, guys. Uh, okay, we're going to start out. Uh, we're going to look at his profile. He is a gold rank player and he is turns of the seasons. I am using this of Circadia. So by now, if you guys don't know, I discard a card. Am I going first? I am going first here. Okay. So let's burn a card. There's a couple options now I can use here. Uh, but I'm not gonna, I'm going to burn him. Keep him in my hand. Pass the turn. So I'll discard a card. The whole point is to recur stuff out of the bottom of my graveyard. So he's going to... Okay. So whatever he's planning on upping, I'll just discard, I guess, right? I mean, unless it's like that red card or something like that. But uh, there's plenty of ways for me to get around what he just did right now. Okay, cool. All right. So now I have a green. I don't need two of these guys. Not a, not right now, at least. Uh, so I will heal and we'll discard a card. And honestly, I can wait to discard a card. No, nah, let's not wait. Let's discard. Who am I going to want to discard here? Who am I going to want to discard? Let's discard him, right? Move over, pass the turn. Okay, so let's see what he does. So I have ways to kind of shuffle things back in and out of the deck. Now, does this make it permanently? Oh, no, it's just, it's just as of, okay. Yeah, so no big deal. Okay, I am going to... First, let's draw a card before we burn. Good. So I'll burn. Yeah, I'll still burn him, I guess, right? Let's. Because I have the. Let's not. Let's burn him. Move over once. And then pass the turn. So, like right now, I can literally discard this guy, right? But I have ways of shuffling back in the deck, so I won't even discard him. I won't even bother. I don't need to discard him. So let's see what happens, guys. Let's see if he finally plays a creature. My Colobok is going to have a huge advantage. As of right now, he's running green, purple. Okay, cool. So now I'm just I'm going to take out my own Colobok. Okay, so let me ask you a question, guys. Should I just play my creature here? Well, what we can do is move over one. Let's kill him. All right. Let's move. Let's detain him. Let's just burn this right now. Heal up. Discard a card. Okay, put it back into my hand. Okay, so let's see what he's going to do. So now, the next turn I can draw something. I don't know. I have four spirits to bring something back in the graveyard, but I don't see... I don't know why I'm not picking any of them up. Okay. Well, I'm going to return that to his hand. Yeah, he can look, but that's fine. But I'm going to return that to his hand and then heal up and try to draw a card if I don't get anything worth having at the moment. Okay. So this is worth having. So we'll play him. Draw a card. Okay. Okay. Let's still put him back in his hand. 
And let's uh, burn a card. Did I heal? I did not. Let's do that. And put him into our hand. Pass the turn. Okay, so he's probably going to swift use his ability. Nope, he didn't use the ability, so he's going to put that creature back down. Well, you know, the cool thing, guys, now I'm at six, so I can actually literally put him back down. All right, so I'm going to use, I don't care about that, guys. Uh, and I don't even care right now. I just want to draw because now I'm going to start, I want to put some red down, get at least five red down as fast as possible. Because I'm at, what, one, two, three, four. I'm at, like, seven mana right now. Okay. That's another good card to have in, in his deck, that artifact he just burnt. I would like to have that. Okay. Cool, man. Not a problem. All right. So now I'll play this again. And that's the other one. Nice. I don't think I need two of them, but let's do, let's burn this because he might just kill one. Let's heal up. I'm at 29 life, so I can afford to take six. Discard this, put it back into my hand, and then pass the turn. Okay, so his ability is return to your hand from the boneyard at the end of your turn. He gives a creature with four or less uh, rush. And he has Lurker, Life Tap, all that, all that fun stuff. So right now, uh, who is he going to play? Okay. Okay. That's annoying. That is annoying. Do I have a way to actually get rid of that? I can steal it, I guess, if I can draw that. Oh, okay. I have a couple of ways. I can return it to his hand and stuff like that. Okay, cool. So what's about to happen right now? is I'm going to play this. Let's play this. Okay. Now I have another creature into my hand, right? Cool. Then we can... Draw a card. So the card I will draw is this one. Burn it. Okay, I don't I don't have a spell to play. He's gonna take out my creature, but if he decides to actually take it out, uh yeah, he's gonna take that out and not take my creature out. And then I, now I'm gonna start uh drawing here a little bit. So this guy is annoying when you can't get rid of it, right? The immortal crap. Oh my goodness, guys. Oh man, I can't stand purple. I really can't stand purple, man. Purple when decks you it, it I'm trying to try a new deck out and they, they gotta pick the shit I, I, I sorry guys for my language. They gotta pick the stuff I can't get rid of, man. Um anyway, so let's see here. He, su he suppressed me. This guy has... This guy is totally broken for three. Blast three. Stealth. The minion opposite lane has zero lock. Like, come on. That's ridiculous. For just three. Damn, bro Damn purple. Broken. Come on, man. Let's go. Let's go. Let's move on. Okay. So, I will... And then he just... I didn't even realize he just used that. But, Okay. So, um, yeah, let's banish two cards. Okay, let's burn this. Let's move this over. Let's draw three more cards. Okay. I already burnt the card. 
let's heal. Discarding this guy, right? And we already burnt the card. Let's pass turn. Yeah, guys, this is ridiculous. I gotta play purple, man. Gotta play purple. He's gonna move it over. Jeez, dude. Jeez. There's nothing I can do about this. This is ridiculous, man. I need to get rid of this dude right here. And I'm gonna do it right now. Actually, I'm gonna totally do it right now. I'm 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 tired of this. Okay. I'm tired of this, guys. Sorry. This is so annoying. Okay, let's move on. Cool. So we'll burn this one. Right? We'll play this. We'll play this. All right. Kill that off. Nope. Let's heal. Yes. Put that back. Now the Slayer is gone. Okay. Hold it right there. Okay, cool. That thing is gone. So watch. Now he's going to play the thing that gives you negative two, negative two. Watch this, guys. Watch this. Watch this. He's going to look at it. He's looking for it right now. He's literally looking for it right now. Or he's going to spirit me right now or make my guy into a spirit. Um, I don't know. He probably has nothing but purple in his hand right now. So let's see. And that's eight. And the next turn I could play my guy. Okay. All right. He's going to try to draw a card. He's not going to try to draw a card. He is going to draw a card. Okay. Try what? Draw another card. Nope. Hilarious. Are both of these in the graveyard? Both of these are in the graveyard. Okay. So... What I'm going to do now, guys, is let's heal a little bit here, right? Let's heal a little bit. Okay, I would have to discard a card right now. I don't want to do that. Let's play this. Let's play this. Let's just get rid of this. Hit him for two. Pass the turn. So even if he has the negative two, negative two guy, uh, which he probably is, he's going to play something big right now. He's going to probably kill me off right now. Uh, but that's not fine, but whatever. Uh, what I can do is start searching for stuff that I already burnt. And by the way, guys, you can look at your deck list by this little arrow right here. And this is what's in the deck. The orange is... So what is that? One, two, three, four, six. Okay, so that's the guy with... Um... Okay, I know who that is. That's the guy with Immortal or whatever. So we can't do that yet. So let's do this. He's trying to make his way over here. Uh, so we draw two cards. So he has Immortal and uh, he can hit any... Agile. All right, so let's see what he has. I already know he has it. Okay, so I figured that. So I just wanted to make sure. Let's put... Uh, so we just draw three cards. Well, I'm going to be able to hit him, gain three life. So that works out. Let's draw three. So I'm at nine right now. And let's do me a favor and take him over, right? 
then we can do this. Let's get this back. Let's discard uh, this. I don't need that. Okay. And then I will pass the turn. But he'll probably steal it back right now, right? Because that's the way the game works. Or turn into... I don't care. As long as you steal it back. Hit me for two. Now he's trying to take out my uh, enchantment here. But now I'm going to bring back a creature. Now I'm going to... Even better. Let's do this. Wait, should we bring back a creature? No, let's just do this. I ain't even going to mess around with all that. Okay. Let's... Heal up. Discard a card. That would be this. What are my bottom two cards? Okay, yes. So that is perfect, actually. Let's banish those two. So now my speed guy is going to be on, on top. So now, if I can just literally... Can I... Have I... Did I do this this turn? Let's put this into our hand, put that, and pass the turn. Okay, so he's in a... Oh, my goodness, guys. Did I just let him do that? But let me ask you a question. By him doing that, do I have Fatal on the board? Because it does look like I have Fatal on the board. Because I can... It looks like I have Fatal. If I had to guess right, because right now what I can do is lose half my life and draw four cards. Because that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm digging for answers right now, guys. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. So he's going to destroy one. He's going to destroy another. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, he's definitely got some answers right now, without a doubt. There's no doubt about that. Let's look at this. What is what is costing zero? Can someone answer this question for me? All right, anyway. Um, let's lose half my life and draw four cards. One, two, three, four. Okay. So let's move this over. Let's move this over. Let's destroy all three of these guys, hopefully. Okay, now we got to figure something else out here, guys. That has, um, hold on, can we look in our deck and see if we can use something here? Nope. Uh, let's make some room, I guess. First, let's hit this guy. Let's hit him. And what do I have? Seven. Let's play this. Here. Right? Let's heal. Drawing a card. Sure, let's play him. Um, let's hit him. And then let's put a guy in that so we can heal. All right. Let's hit him again. Oh, I ended the turn. But why does he have 11 life? Did he gain life in this process? Did he gain life with somebody? Uh, no, he did not. That's weird. So 
So is he going to put his big guy out? Because you know he has it. He has 18 cards in his deck. And I only have 10 cards in my deck, guys. But he knows right now he plays that dude. He's dead. Okay. So he's going to do three damage, which actually works out for me. That actually works out for me, guys. I think that, I think that works out for me really good. Because now what I'll do is I'm going to kill my spirit off and give all my creatures haste, right? So I don't care if he does that, if he kills those three guys. And I'm going to be able to zap him. Okay, so let's take this out. All right, so let's just take this out so I don't have it in the way. Let's zap him. Okay. Well, I don't, I don't want, I want to make sure I don't do anything stupid here. Let's play this. All right. Let's give it a mortal. Let's hit him right now. Okay, cool. And now I can kind of abuse him a little bit. Let's play this. All right. Uh, let's play this. All right. And then, oh, no, would this cost me something? No, I don't want that anyway. Actually, I should have searched, but here. We can do this. All right. Okay, so he only has literally one life left. Um... And then we'll end the turn. Okay. That's cool. Because now if he doesn't kill my vampire, I'm going to zap him and win, right? Unless he can draw life. I mean, unless he has a card where he can gain life. Well, no, he's going to dig for a whole bunch of answers. He could. He can possibly gain it up to like nine life if he has the card in his deck. Uh, No, he's disconnecting. Is he going to disconnect? Just quit, bro. Is not is that not going to count towards his rating or something? His ranking? Is that what he does? Does he just disconnect? Okay. So he's disconnecting, guys. I think that's it. I think that's game. Well, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Um, even if he would have put a creature down, let's say, it wouldn't have mattered because I would have just zapped him for the one. So even it, unless he could have put a big creature in and destroyed every... I mean, I would... Even if he would have had that, that big creature with the armor and all that, uh, that does two damage to each lane and all that stuff. So he would have done four damage to him and then do two damage to everybody, destroying him. But then I would have had the agile, right? He could and he couldn't stop that from happening. So I would have agile. I mean, he could have possibly put his green creature, but he would have not had enough stops. I mean, um, enough blockers, right? And then I would have still had my life tap guy regardless. So yeah, guys, thanks for so much. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'm not going to count down the whole 13 seconds here. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate, uh, appreciate the support. You guys have a great day, all right?